Hello everybody, my name is Phoenix Fire here and welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Vanguard. On the last episode we started the big tournament um, and uh, things went a little bit awry uh, and now we have to go find um, uh, Destiny. Uh, and yes, I'm feeling a lot better now as you can see and the uh, big weekend away party in the house was a success. Um, everything went okay and everything and we got back all right and just yesterday I was just knackered so that's why there wasn't any episodes of yesterday I do apologize for that but yeah let's go shall we let's see and now we're just looking for destiny so oh hello there she is destiny destiny you he was right. No, no, he's wrong. They were right. Who? What? Destiny, whatever the asshole said to you, he was wrong. You aren't. No, I don't get. No, yeah. No, don't get it, do you? They were right about me. I'm just... I'm going back to the academy. Bye, Quilotus. Destiny! No! Don't listen to what they said. You're stronger than you think. I promise you that no matter what, that's I'll win this thing. I'll win it for you. Destiny. Attention trainers and spectators. Round one of the quarterfinals between Quillotus and Zeke will begin in 10 minutes. Competitors please proceed either right or the doors, left doors of the tournament hall. Okay then, so yeah, first of all we're going to go to the Pokemon Center, of course. Just to heal up everyone and get everyone ready. Are you ready for the battle? Uh, kinda? Yeah? <sighs> Greetings of Ariel, and welcome to the quarterfinals of the RLM Battle Festival. Okay. On the left we have Quillotus from House F of Vanguard Academy. And on the right we have Zeke from House F of Vanguard Academy. Yep. Not only are they from the same academy but from the same house as well. Things are about to get interesting. <laughs> You're in my way. Zeke, I'm not sure how much this means to you, but that doesn't matter to me anymore. I'm winning this battle. And the two after. <laughs> to you this might be just fun and games. To you, this might just be the gateway to becoming the strongest Pokemon trainer. But I have a reason to win this. I need to show the world who I am. So you better lose that shitty little main character act. Wow, okay. Because I'm not leaving here without a first place medal. Well, alright then, off we go! Let's see if we have Lily, Coco, Inti, Kiro, Nocturne and Marshall against Zeke, who really does look like Bakuga from My Hero Academy. And yep, first of all, it's got Skarmory and Graveler, okay. So, with Lily, I'm gonna go for, um. Bullet Punch straight away, and for Kiro, I'm gonna go for Skarmory. A bullet Punch! Okay, yeah, that doesn't really do too much. Evolve switch on Scarlet. That does quite a bit, okay. 
Right then, now I'm going to swap out to... Uh, I think maybe Inti this time. Yep, more breaker, okay. My acrobatic, so much as I do to Lily. Oh god, sends her down into the yellow. Rock team on Lily as well. No! Okay, Lily fainted. Okay then. I do have a clause for if Lily goes down, but we shall see this. If I wipe here, then that's the end of Vanguard. Right, okay. Yeah, mirror shot. That's gonna be slash. Oh, and that was a critical hit, so okay, normally it doesn't do too much. Be a draining kiss. And yep, thank you. Yep, I played a Skarmory. Fainted. Thank you to uh, Kira, we're going to give it hell. <laughs> Bulldoze, Kira's levitate, so Kira doesn't get hit. A little Inti does fall. Hardly anything, okay then. The speed does fall. Right, get a bite, okay? This is perfect, so I am going to do another uh, mirror shot on Graveler and Diggity's uh, attack of Gabite. <laughs> A mirror shot takes out the Graveler, thank you. And yeah, Gabite uses Metal Claw, who takes it into down into the yellow. But that did uh, quite a bit to Gabite. Okay, you're basculine. Okay, that's fair. No Basque Legion, thank god. Let's see, I'm going to use the same attack again. And yep, one volt which takes down the Basque Legion because, of course, weak to electric. Right, I'm going to send out, uh, send out Marshall now. Right, okay, now what's going to come out is... Let's go by it. Right, one more draining kiss. Alright, and that's it for Zeke. Okay, cool. <laughs> I for some reason thought he was going to have um, one or two more peeps. <laughs> I don't know why. But yeah, alright. <laughs> Sorry, Zeke. Come on. It's not over yet. I still have one more Pokemon. Uh, how? Let's finish this then. Oh, shit. <clears throat> no, not this. Not now. The hell are you waiting for? You said this matter meant something to you. You said you needed to win. Then prove it, damn it. I I can't. Zeke. Destiny. I'm sorry. Oh wait, did we just pass out or something? Oh Christ, of all the times for that to come up, we Lotus. Where am I? Back at the academy. You collapsed in the middle of your battle with Zeke. Technically, the, at the start of round two. Oh, how long have I been out? A little less than two days, holy shit. The nurse said you collapsed due to overexhaustion. But you were really possessed. Oh. <laughs> you better be getting your sleep, damn it. Taking care of yourself is one of the most important parts of being a trainer. Right. Have I really been resting well enough? Wait, so. What happened? Apart from me just getting a text. 
You collapse you collapse in the middle of your battle with Zeke. Uh you know, the tournament. Wait, destiny. Jesus, I guess you're awake. Destiny, where is she? In her room last time I checked. Well, Otis. You're still in no condition to wander about. But I... No buts. Get back to sleep, damn it. Okay. So, you've heard me, right? <clears throat> My call for help? It's actually quite frustrating. I could talk to you as much as I'd like. But not once I've gotten a response. Well, not once have I gotten a response. Are you ignoring me? Or are you just unable to respond? I like to think the latter. Either way, I can't tell you where I am. Because, well, I don't know where I am. Okay. I'm surrounded by tall mountains. Yeah. And I can hear movement all around me. I haven't had a look finding food or water. But I have the feeling I'll be fine. It's you that I'm worried about. Wait, I can hear... This crap again? Why though? Am I going insane? <laughs> no, who am I kidding? It's incredibly normal to hear voices in your head. Maybe I should talk to someone about this. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, alright. Uh, I lost. What? After you fainted. I continued to the third round and lost some purple haired chick. Oh. Who then went to lose to my brother? Dot dot dot. I don't know what the hell was up with you, but don't let that shit happen again. There are very few people in this world who could be at the top. And my brother won't be one of them. Zane, right? Can't say I disagree with you. So, you also had a run-in with him? He makes sure anyone who isn't on his level knows it. Destiny. Which is why your ass better be ready to give a proper beating next time we run into him. Alright. Okay. Now get the hell out of here. I'm trying to read, damn it. Uh, right. Oh yeah, by the way. I saw Destiny by the courtyard this morning. Uh, thank you. Okay then, so now we're going to be on the lookout for Destiny again. Right, oh, there she is. Hello. Destiny. I, well... I wasn't able to win the tournament for you. Like I promised. Huh? 
But Lotus, what are you talking about? You know, the tournament where, well, you know. Oh! Yeah, don't worry about it. <laughs> what? Oh. I mean, I overreacted a bit. That guy, he was a dick. Uh, an asshole. Yeah. Like, who the heck does he think he is walking around telling everyone that they suck? Yeah, screw that guy. <laughs> What's so funny? No, I just don't see you smile often. You always look like there's a million things on your mind. Which is... Which I guess there probably is. Uh, what's wrong? Well, I just feel bad. Ever since we met, you've been there for me countless times. And I haven't once even attempted to help you with your whole, like, you know... Destiny. I mean, like, I want to help, but I really just don't know how. Destiny. Wait, no, that's a crappy excuse. Destiny. God, I really suck at this. Destiny. Huh. You're fine, okay? But... Destiny, I'm fine. You better not be lying. Ugh. Listen to me, Quilotis. We're gonna graduate from this academy. And then once we're really trainers, we'll travel the world and search for a solution to your problem. You hear me? Bzzzd. Huh? My phone? Oh, I forgot, Wyla wanted me to help her with something. I gotta go, Quilotis. See you. What I've learned about this world so far... It's a beautiful place filled with beautiful and mysterious creatures. I've had a struggle trying to find my way, but I've finally decided. I'm going to help Destiny achieve her dream. And I may be lost, but I've met some amazing people so far. And with my friends and Pokemon on my side, I felt like I could achieve anything. So yeah, that's my goal. I'm going to graduate this academy and see the rest of this world has to offer. Yeah, awesome. I mean, I guess it just bothers me. The idea that my daughter is constantly away. And especially with all the problems she has. Jackie, she'll be fine. She's a good hands. Keith knows what he's doing. You really trust him that much? He's one of the highest members in the Alliance Council. And the fact that he's my own brother, of course I trust him. I guess you're right. Anyways, I gotta get back to work. Things don't stay calm for very long up here. I'll talk to you later. I wish you stopped by sometimes, you know. I would if I could. I'm sorry. Click. Maybe he's right. Maybe I'm just being paranoid. Someone at the door? Amelia. 
I'm a Lyra. Yes, I'm a Lyra. I. Oh, hi. What? You. Why are you here? After all I've done for you, I would have expected better introduction. Alright. Dot, dot, dot. You know where you stand with this Jackie and... I'm a Lyra. Have you really not changed your name after all this time? Even after what they did... What the hell do you want, Zenth? I want the information you have. Oh, on the Alliance. You have very good relationships with some very important people. Do you really think I'm going to cooperate with someone like you? Someone like me? As in the one who's... Uh... Don't remind me, damn it! I don't even have the type of information you're looking for. You really think I'd share anything with me? They'd share anything with me? No, I don't think they would share information with an outcast like you. Dot dot dot. Then why the hell are you here? Because you're the only one, Emma I have leverage over. Outcast or not. Just having that name makes you important. So figure something out. What the hell do you want from the Alliance so badly? What's the point of raising an army of renegades if you're going to make someone like me do all the work? Oh, okay. It's not an army. I'm waging war with the Alliance isn't our goal. In fact, that would only make things worse for us. What I want for the Alliance goes a lot deeper than you understand. So use that family name of yours and give me what I want. I'll take away the life I gave back to you years ago. Why did it have to be him? Of all the people in this world, to save my daughter. Yay, chapter 10 available, woo.